All right, coming up next, it's a featherweight championship fight between Max Holloway and Brian Ortega. So here he is, the number one featherweight contender, making his walk to the octagon for this UFC featherweight championship opportunity. It's been a long time coming. No denying he is worthy of this chance, and he believes he's the best featherweight in the world. His opportunity to prove it is now just a few short moments away. As he makes his way towards the cage, his preparation has been perfect. He is in fantastic shape, had an amazing camp, and he believes that he is in the perfect position to become the new champion of the world. As he steps into the octagon right now, he steps in with a champion's mindset. Well, Joe Rogan, this man has goals well beyond being the UFC featherweight champion of the world. That is the title that accompanies him as he makes the walk here tonight. He has won this belt. He has defended it in the past. But he wants to be the greatest featherweight of all time. And to do that, you need more title defenses, more dominant performances, more finishes. He wants to be mentioned with the Hall of Fame types. In order to do that tonight, absolutely one he's got to have. The champion is in focus. He is in his prime. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this camp has been absolutely spectacular. He believes he has a solid game plan, and his mentality coming into this fight is clear and focused. the tape for this featherweight championship fight. Both fighters are 26. Holloway is three inches taller. The reach is identical. And now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon where we find the venerable Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. This is the moment U.S. fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! I round the undisputed UFC featherweight championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist for the professional record of. 14 wins, no losses, and one no contest. He stands 5 feet 8 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out Los Angeles, California, presenting the challenger, Brian T. City Ortega! And now, introducing the champion, fighting out the red corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of. 19 wins, three losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Waianae, Hawaii, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC featherweight champion of the world, Max Plus Holloway. UFC belt on the line. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. They touch him up, and we are underway. You ready? You ready? All right, here we go. The UFC featherweight title is on the line. It does not get any bigger than this. <laughs> Opens with the left hand and lands flush. got tagged there. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. Look at that. Nice. 
Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. Nice punch there by T-City. Brian Ortega immediately shoots for the leg. Inside control. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. to north-south. And he establishes full mount. He postures into place. Showing some good defense here, trapping that arm. Back to full mount again. Big shot. He's working from full mount again. It looks like he's hunting for an arm here. He's got the arm here. Now he's gonna throw his leg over. It looks like this submission's locked. Throw the leg over the face. This arm bar is very tight. He may have to tap any second now. Oh and my God! will do it! Beautiful technique in winning this fight by armbar. Yeah, that's about as good as he's looked in the grappling realm, and he stayed focused on the armbar. He kept going back to the well for it, and ultimately, in the middle of this fight, he gets the tap. That is a big finish for that young man here tonight. And here's the end. And one more time from this angle, we can see that armbar locked in tight for the tap. And finally, one more time, no choice but to tap. Well, hard not to feel good for the UFC featherweight champion of the world, not only getting the job done here tonight, but getting the finish as well. A huge submission and one of the bigger performances of his UFC career. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 21 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out and new undisputed UFC featherweight champion of the world, Brian T. City Ortega. Well, how about it, ladies and gentlemen? There he is, the new king at 145 pounds becoming the UFC featherweight champion tonight. And by way of submission, I might add, incredible, incredible result here tonight. And now he celebrates with his coaches and sparring partners an unbelievable